guys welcome back to a new um weekly i'm kind of makeupless and i've just been to the gym and i'm literally wearing a dressing gown and upper print trousers because comfort is key so i'm home because i've got quite a lot of work to do film videos chill all of that stuff but my mum has just whipped up, oh my god, as she calls it, a Yorkshire lunch, which I'm very excited about. And it's really funny, someone tweeted me the other day, and I didn't know if they were being sarcastic or not, they weren't. Being like, oh, are you from Yorkshire? I didn't know. And I was like, what do you mean you didn't know? I talk about it all the time. So yeah, I'm back home in Yorkshire, for those of you who don't know, I live in London and Yorkshire, and we are just having a nice lunch before I get on with a day of filming, so I can't wait to eat this. <laughs> Sunday lunch on Saturday. Yes, please. Brussels sprouts and it's not even Christmas. Hello. I'm just sorting out stuff for a video as you can see lots of Zara bags and I'm just on this chair which is like the chair that I fall asleep in if you ever wonder where I am in this house I'm usually asleep on this chair we were just talking at lunch which was fantastic by the way about how important and integral napping is and how napping is a big part of everyone's life and it should be done more and Look, now look at me, I feel like napping, but I need to get up and film this video, but this chair is just, the minute I get on it, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna sleep. It's like a spinny chair. It's so nice with my garden behind. So now I am actually gonna go and put some makeup on and film. We were just saying we need some chocolate so that we can spur ourselves on, and here we go, in my blogger mail, my gifted stuff, some chocolate arrived. So me and my mum, excuse my nail, this is showing how what a mess my life is right now and how busy I am. So we're gonna have a chocolate, so cheers to that. different person and now the filming begins so my house is an actual tip oh my god storm doris is loud my house is an actual tip because i'm always filming hence the like constant cameras and stuff being set up but you know gotta do what you gotta do for the youtube so you guys can watch it and enjoy so yeah put like the biggest makeup bag together of new stuff to try on and now i am going to film a haul So, video done. I'm filming a few videos this weekend. I just quickly want to show you this blazer that I bought. Oh my goodness, I actually really like it. I never thought that pink was my colour. I think it makes me look like a bit very, very blonde. It's like a bit um, Barbie-ish and I'm even, I've even got pink lips to go with it today. But this oversized blazer with these jeans, I actually think it's really flattering. I'll link it below if you want to get it because I think it will sell out for spring. But I was like, oh, I actually really like this. And so now I'm going to go put some little hampers together in my office. One for one of my followers, she's so nice, she messages me all the time. So I've been doing this thing where basically just throughout the year I will give gifts to my followers over on Instagram and I'll like flag their messages and then when I come home I put some nice little hampers together so she'll be get getting that soon. And eight other people got them like a few weeks ago so that just made my day. And then I'm seeing some friends this evening, one of them has had a baby, she's like my bestest friend from school. Um, we're going to help her with bath time. <laughs> and then my other friend, it was her birthday so I'm going to go sort out her birthday present and get that all wrapped as well I just love giving back to people I think it's so 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 nice when I did my wardrobe video I'm sure you heard me say I give to charity literally every single week but one thing I started doing a few years ago just kind of behind the scenes was giving away gifts to my followers um I just randomly messaged them and be like thanks for supporting me I see your comments and messages and can I send you something can I get your address and they're like what that's a bit weird but no but then they get a present and I always stalk their Instagram to see like if they're into lipstick or hair care or whatever and um it's just a really nice way to make someone's day so Happy blazer on. So, happy blazer on. Super happy with this. And now I'm going to go sort these presents out. So here are just a few little things that I'm putting together. So while I'm in my office, this arrived. This is, was kindly gifted to me. It is a gifted press product for me to review. And it came from Joy Loves. So Joy Loves is owned by Joy Malone. It's Joy Malone. Actually, the lady Joy Malone. It's her new brand. And it's fantastic. And this is their new pair of hand wash and hand lotion. Oh my goodness. And this is so thoughtful. They sent me it with a towel 
that says E and M, M and Matt, my boyfriend. And honestly, that is just so thoughtful. It literally knocked me back and made my day. Um, and it says, Dear M, the perfect new pair for the perfect pair. Happy Valentine's Day from Joe Loves. This will be launching at the end of the month on Space and Kate and Joe Loves. And oh my god, I just can't believe how beautiful this is and the fact that they went out of their way to do this for me. So thank you. That is literally so thoughtful. So I made an Instagram account called M Shelley Shell, which is like my reality well i don't know i just it's not actually there is reality stuff on there stuff that doesn't make the m chalette's grid but i also just like post things on the grid that don't make the grid so like mirror shots and all that stuff and i was just filming some insta stories showing the aftermath of filming in my house look at this this is it my mom just walked upstairs and was like why are you laid on the floor guys it's very exhausting filming <laughs> and um, look this is this is organized mess this is how on point I have to be with my organization and people get mad at my house being messy but what can I say girls gotta film hauls so I just thought I'd give you a little insight sorry mum good morning guys it's now Tuesday I am back in London now reluctantly the last few days in Yorkshire have been amazing I've done lots and lots of work but also spent some time with family hence me not filming on the vlog it was really really lovely so now yeah back in London I've got a busy day I was gonna go up an hour early today and actually go and do some exercise but honestly sleep is more important and I really needed to sleep I've got a really sore throat so I thought I would just up so I have a busy day of meetings and events this morning. I am heading, oh my gosh, see my voice. First I have, I'm actually going to the H&M showroom that invited me go, to go and check some stuff out, not an ad. Um, I'm gonna film a separate video of that. And then I'm going to see my friend Emily for some muffins and coffee, <laughs> needed. And then GHD are launching a new product, I think. So they've invited me to their gifted press day. It's like a press launch, not an ad. <laughs> and I'm going to get a blow dry and my nails done at dry by, which I'm very excited for because wow, this is like getting a bit embarrassing now. Oh my god, I can't even get my voice out. My voice is like, no. Good. Hello, you guys. Oh my goodness. I have got the worst voice. This is me trying to talk. So, it's a new day. I can't even tell you what happened yesterday because I don't have a voice. So I'm gonna wait until my voice comes back and then hopefully tell you. I'm heading to a gifted breakfast now, a press event with Origins. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Morning guys, I really want to tell you about yesterday because I went to see an osteopath in more detail but I'm going to wait till I've got a voice. Um, so I've just been for breakfast, it's very cold, I'm now just walking through Hyde Park. It was a gifted press breakfast with Origins, I already love their lip balms and a lot of their face masks. So it was for the launch of their new foundation, can't wait to try it. Got to catch up with all my friends which was amazing. Walking through Hyde Park now because I have a gifted press facial with SkinCeuticals. So excited. It's like a two hour facial. Try not to get run over. Why are they going to tell me everything about my skin? So I'm actually so excited for this. It's meant to be insane. Should stop High Street Kensington in London. As you can tell I can't speak. I'm trying. I'm not going to get run over. Um, so I'll try to fill you in as I can. Yeah, let's go. So I'm just going to give you a few samples today. So this was your Floratine CF. So this is your vitamin C serum. So it's your antioxidant for the day, but it's gonna be amazing for you because you have a little bit of pigmentation in the skin, slightly oiliness in the skin, so that's going to be the best one to use. Thereafter, we'll use a discoloration defense serum. So this is amazing for if you have any discoloration, any pigmentation, just to block that transfer from coming to the surface of the skin. So that has your transexamic acid in there, so that's what's going to help 
target the discoloration. Thereafter, I want you to use the HA intensifier, which is amazing for plumping, hydration. Um, so this is also known as a filler in a bottle because it has your proxylane in there. So that's gonna be everyone's favorite product to use. Um, and last but not least, your blemish and age defense serum. So this is only when you have an occasional breakout on the skin. It's nice just to pop on as a treatment, um, just in areas of concern. You can pop it all over if you need to, but for your skin particularly, I would only put it on areas of concern where you have that occasional breakout, okay? Hey guys, I still have no voice. Um, had such a lovely day. I can't speak. <laughs> um, the most amazing facial with SkinCeuticals. So hopefully you heard what the lady said at the end of the treatment. I went to a place called Cavendish Clinic. It was amazing. I learned so much about my skin. And I'm hoping that tomorrow I can talk to you properly. Let's see. So I'm just cooking some pizza and doing some work in my dressing gown. Um, so yeah, sorry. Good morning, guys. It's now a whole week later. And I'm wearing the same dress because I'm obsessed with that. I found a um, similar version because it's sold out, so I'll link it below. I'm still super not very good, which is annoying. But I'm still smiling. I am... Um, I had the busiest week ever last week. I ended up having to put the vlogging camera away and just take a bit of time to actually get my health back on track. And we're still not there. It's now been eight days since I've worked out, which is kind of annoying. Um, but you've got to listen to your body. So I went on the most insane trip, which obviously I was unwell for, but I still managed to do it. <laughs> so that's going to be a separate vlog. And then at the weekend, I'd already planned dinner with my Canadian friends, which I couldn't cancel. So that strained my voice even more. But I'm so grateful that I got to see my friends and it's just set me back a little bit. I think I should have been better a week on. So anyway, I'm vlogging today. I probably shouldn't be, but my family are coming to visit. We have a very exciting day. I can't show you some of it because <laughs> it's a secret, but I can show you the other half. Um, I'm so excited to see my mum. So first, I'm actually going to film like a TV pilot for a TV show that might be getting commissioned. So fingers crossed on that one I'm just taking part in that and so I need my voice <laughs> and then after that I'm meeting my family and taking them for brunch at one of my favorite places in London and chicken bites they're like vegan chicken bites but they're really good <laughs> and then mum and I have been kindly invited for a gifted press treatment at the Elemis townhouse it's insane so mum's gonna have a facial I had an amazing facial last week with SkinCeuticals that was gifted and it was just insane. Um, my skin felt amazing. So I'm going to have a massage instead if I don't have a coughing fit. So I had a massage on Saturday and I had to stop halfway through because I was choking. <laughs> and then mum and I have been invited for a very exciting stayover with a brand, a gifted stayover. So I will take you to that later. It's so cool that I get to take my mum to this. So I'm going to rest my voice and then have a walk to go and do this little TV thing. Um, and my mum was asking if it was big enough. <laughs> so we've got the chicken bites and the nacho bowl to start. Mum is here! changed because I went for lunch and did loads of stuff, lunch was very good. And now we have just checked in to the Treehouse Hotel with my mum because Ren Skincare have kindly invited me to stay here for the night. It's a gifted press day and yeah, let's have a look around and show you some of the stuff. So here is the bed and we've got a little bag for life and everything basically has these little things on it that says that where everything's from. So this was made from 300 recycled plastic bottles, which is insane. There's a sloth on the bed, and wait, they've put products everywhere. This is so exciting. I've used Ren before quite a lot of their products, but I've never used some of these. This is exciting. Their pillow spray. Here we have these gorgeous plants. We've got Global Protection Day Cream. This is insane. I've used this before. Clean Screen Mineral SPF 30 Mattifying Sun Cream. No chemical UV filters, no silicone. And look, even little things like this. So they've put paper flowers here because cut flowers have a high carbon footprint. So these are little paper ones. I absolutely love matcha, so this is a dream. These are actually already some of my favorite snacks. So this is very exciting. 
Also, they've kindly given me this cup, which says it's the only reusable cup that is made from single-use cups. How cool is that? I'm waiting until you see the view that my mum is already checking out. Look at that view. So you've got a view of the whole of London. And then we go around here. Oh, and you've got the most divine bath. Again, even like these are made from 100% recycled bottles, which is so amazing. And I'm so excited to use this Atlantic Kelp and Microalgae Anti Fatigue Bath Oil from Ren with the dreamiest M shell bath and more views. How insane! And then you go in here, they've even done the bin, zero waste by 2021, recyclable, reusable or compostable packaging, Ren Clean Skincare, clean to skin, clean to planet, clean skin, clean to planet, Ren Skincare. Okay, so the new product is this little, small but mighty, the Overnight Glow, the Dark Spot Sleeping Cream, and it is clinically proven to reduce the appearance of dark spots from seven days. So as I said, this is not sponsored, this is kindly gifted it's a press day but this is so lovely that they have organized all of this there's just so many products here for me to try the clean jelly oil cleanser i've used this before it's very good the ready steady glow ah tonic i've not used this one but this was amazing a gentle cleansing gel and even the shower has products inside it which is just so exciting i've used this product before when it first launched i was so excited this bottle is made from ocean plastic and it's their anti-fatigue body wash and I was very impressed when I first saw that come and then yeah how insane so I'm now at change for dinner the dress that I've literally been wearing since I bought it every single day because I absolutely love it with my boots we headed for our little gifted press treatments at the house of Elemis and oh my goodness they were insane it's kind of like an annual thing because my mum had her first ever facial there a few years ago and we were both blown away so she had a facial I had one recently so I had a massage and oh my goodness it was my second massage in like a week and she still said I had knots everywhere but I was so impressed with how much she kind of understood my back and stuff. She was like, yeah, you've got some serious knots. It was such a good, intense, deep massage. So now we're heading for dinner at Treehouse Hotels. Ren Skincare have kindly gifted me this as part of the stay. And I'm taking my mom and my brother. So we're gonna go have a Mexican feast with views of London. Let's go. We have had such a lovely morning. Thank you so much, Ren, for having us. We used the lovely products, we had a lovely breakfast, we had lovely views, and I had an amazing bath. <laughs> we are now heading back to mine because I have some work to do. Oh, ah, sloth! We have a sloth pillow. How cute is this? Um, a sloth pillow, unfortunately, we can't take this home. Um, and then we have an exciting lunch, so I'll talk to you about that later. But yeah, bye from the Treehouse Hotel, it was fun home now we had such a nice day just been shooting lots of content and now we are heading over to a place i think you pronounce it linian spa linian it's kind of like a day spa or a beauty I don't really know what they call it i'd say it's like a mini beauty hall i've never been before but i've seen loads of people talk about it it's in the kind of nine elms Vauxhall area of london and they basically do everything from blow dries to treatments to facials to massages to eyebrows to nails literally everything so they've kindly invited my mum and i for gifted press appointments so we can have our nails done which is exciting and then they've invited us to go for a little gifted brunch afterwards so i'm very excited to go there and then head back and we have dinner tonight it's a day of eating and my throat's actually it's still sore but it's a little bit better so happy days I'm gonna keep drinking the tea Yo sé que tú quieres moverlo sin pena, ven, sin estrés, muéstrame sus pasos, te cuento hasta 
Look at the new nails. Look good. Our next meal, I'm taking my family to La Famiga Art on my nails, obsessed with them. Lunch is amazing. I'm um, taking my family to La Famiga because they've never been and it's literally my favourite Italian restaurant left. <laughs> um, and I actually came here on Saturday with my friend, I was so ill. I still ate all the carbs. So I've taken them to try my favourite Italian. It's amazing, it's like family run. It's so good. So I'm home now. Oh gosh, we've just been outside in the cold and it's probably not done the best for my throat. I'm trying to decide if I should finally work out tomorrow. First time in eight days because I've been ill, but I think it might make me worse. So I'm not sure because we're going skiing this weekend. So keep an eye on my stories for skiing. I dropped my hoops out because they were hurting. My mum has gone home now, back to Yorkshire. Had the best two days of her ever. Um, literally just, oh, miss her so much. I love spending time with her. So I'm going to say goodbye to this vlog now, give my voice more of a rest, and I will see you guys on the next vlog. So I'm starting a new vlog tomorrow because so I've got lots going on before I go skiing at the weekend. So love you guys lots. Everything mentioned is linked below. If you made it this far, you are amazing. Comment and let me know that you made it this far. And you can come say hi on Instagram and Twitter at Big love, guys. Thank you for watching.